A mother in Fort Mill is accused of letting her seven-year-old ride on the car while it was moving. Now, shocking to hear and exactly why someone who saw it called 911. South Carolina reporter Greg Suskin spoke to one of those witnesses. Greg? And both of those witnesses were riding in the same car and they didn't want to be interviewed, but one did tell me over the phone that they were driving through this neighborhood and as soon as they saw that child on top of that car, they immediately called 911. Thank God. If I were here, I would have called 911. Brianna Jarman lives across the street from the woman who was arrested. She's one of several neighbors who told us they're shocked. I think that's scary. That's dangerous. That's that's ridiculous. Fort Mill police charged Tabitha Baird with unlawful conduct toward a child after witnesses say she was driving this car down Michaela Court in her Fort Mill neighborhood with her seven year old son laying on top of the roof. Police couldn't say how long this went on, but did tell us Barrett denied it happened when officers asked her. However, her son told police he was on the roof, and witnesses backed that up. It may have made the only difference between that child being seriously injured or worse. We knocked on the door where the suspect lives with her mother, but no one answered. Jarman doesn't know the family well, but told me she sees the boy out a lot by himself. There's a few other parents that walk their kids up and down the road, and, and that's fine. They're out with adults, but... He just kind of roams. Officers say Barrett was unable to focus and answer their questions. However, she was not charged with DUI or given a field sobriety test. And one of the witnesses who called this into police is a mother of two herself. We're told that child is now in the custody of his grandmother. Back to you. All right, those concerned parents looking out for that young man. Thank you, Greg.